Have you tried planking? Do you love it? It doesn't matter if you love planking or not, but you should plank at least one minute every morning if you want to improve your fitness level. Planks are one form of bodyweight exercise that will never go out of fashion, and the plank exercise benefits are endless. So what really happens if you start doing planks for a minute every morning? Keep on watching this video because today we will talk about what happens to your body if you do a one minute plank every morning. Stay tuned. The importance of core strength. There are numerous sites and blogs that detail ways to build your core muscles or core strength. However, these sites often neglect to explain what your core muscles actually are and why building them is important. This is quite surprising as core muscles are quite easy to explain. Your core muscles are a series of muscles in your midsection and are used in most forms of movement. Though they aren't housed in your arms or legs, your core muscles can help transfer force from one limb to another or are used in addition to muscles in your arms or legs to increase their effectiveness. As such, a strong core can greatly improve your ability to move and exercise more effectively. Also, they are great for helping other muscles in your midsection, such as your abdominal muscles. Your abdominal muscles are important for supporting your back and spinal column, and so are important aids in preventing injuries. However, for them to be most effective, you need to spend a lot of time developing your core muscles. In short, plank benefits include having a huge improvement in your muscles overall, making them an amazingly effective exercise to perform. I did a one-minute plank every morning, and this happened to my body. There are a few forms of exercise as effective as building your core as a plank workout. However, planks benefit far more than just your core strength. This is why a lot of people love doing planks every morning. By holding yourself in the position for a plank exercise, you'll notice that your biceps, neck, and shoulder muscles are also being tested and strained. This is encouraging their buildup and development, which is great news if you like to do press-ups. When planking, you are holding yourself up through your arms and biceps, and by holding a plank position, your arm muscles are being toned and developed. This makes planks a great alternative exercise to other forms of bicep developing exercises. Moving down your midsection, successful plank exercises actually develop the muscles in your buttocks. These muscles tend to be ignored by a lot of exercises, so this is another great benefit of plank exercises. In much the same way as you develop your biceps and arm muscles, holding planks helps develop the muscles in your thighs too. Before we continue, a like would be great. Number 1. Improved Core Definition Planks are an ideal exercise for the abdominal muscles because they engage all major core muscle groups, including the transverse abdominis, the rectus abdominis, the external obliques, and the glutes. The importance of strengthening each muscle group cannot be underestimated either, for all of these groups serve their own purpose. If you strengthen these muscle groups, you will notice number 1. Transverse abdomini, increased ability to lift heavier weights. Number 2. Rectus abdominis, improved sports performance, particularly with jumping. This muscle group is also responsible for giving you the renowned six pack look. Number 3. Obliques, improved capacity for stable side bending and waist twisting. Number 4. Glutes, a supported back and strong buttocks. Number 2. Decreased risk of back injury. Doing a one-minute plank every morning will allow you to build muscle while also making sure that you are not putting too much pressure on your spine or hips. One of the plank exercise benefits is it can strengthen your back muscles and ensure more support and stability for your entire back, especially in the areas around your upper back. Number 3. Metabolism Boost Planking is an excellent way of challenging your entire body because doing them every morning will burn more calories than other traditional abdominal exercises such as crunches or sit-ups. The core muscles you strengthen by doing this exercise on a day-to-day -day basis will ensure that you burn more energy, even when sedentary because they are some of the largest muscles in the body. This is especially important if you are spending the majority of your day sitting in front of a computer. Also, making it a daily home exercise before or after work will not only provide an enhanced metabolic rate, but will also ensure that your metabolism remains high all day long. Number 4. Improved Posture Planks have a great impact and improvement on your posture. A strong posture brings with it a huge number of fantastic benefits. It keeps your bones and joints in the correct alignment, which means both your bones and joints will be better maintained. But it also means the overall effectiveness of your muscles will be improved. 
A good posture will ensure your back or spine is in the correct position, so you will suffer less back pain. On top of everything else, someone with good posture looks healthier and more confident overall. Number 5. Improved Balance Have you ever felt that when you try standing on one leg, you can't stand up straight for more than a couple of seconds? It's not because you are just clumsy, but rather because your abdominal muscles aren't strong enough to give you the balance you need. Many people assume that balance is mostly based on the legs but most of the work is actually happening in your core as it keeps you stable and upright. By improving your balance by doing side planks and planks with extensions, you will boost your balance and performance in every kind of fitness activity. Number 6. More Flexibility Flexibility is a key benefit of doing planks regularly, as this form of exercise expands and stretches all your posterior muscle groups, shoulders, shoulder blades, and collarbone while also stretching your hamstrings, the arches of your feet, and the toes. With side planks added to the mix, you can also work on your oblique muscles. This will provide you with further benefits when it comes to hyperextending your toes, a movement that is crucial for supporting your body's weight. Number 7. Improved Mood Plank exercises have a particular effect on our nerves, making them an excellent means of improving overall mood. This works because they stretch out muscle groups that contribute to stress and tension in the body. Imagine you are sitting in your chair at home or at work all day long. Your thigh muscles get tight, your legs get heavy due to being bent for several hours, and tension develops in your shoulders due to being forced to slump forward all day. These are all circumstances that put stress on the muscles and nerves. The good news is that planks not only calm your brain, but they can also treat anxiety and symptoms of depression but only if you make it part of your daily routine. How to plank each day You're likely wondering how many planks a day are necessary to see benefits and how long you should hold them. If you can only do one plank a day, then start with that. Aim to hold it for at least 60 seconds, but if you need to start with less, then do so and build up from there. When it comes to how many planks a day you should do, and we recommend striving to do three sets of up to 60 seconds, so this can be a goal you aim when you begin your plank adventure. The most important thing in doing planks every morning is consistency. How to hold a plank position Plank exercise benefits can change your life, but first, you need to know how to do it right. Doing planks correctly takes practice and it will be very difficult until you build up your muscles a bit. Here is an overview to help you get into a regular plank position. Number 1. Get into a push-up position on the floor Number 2. Bend your elbows 90 degrees and rest your weight on your forearms for a forearm plank position. Number 3. Keep your torso straight and rigid and form a straight line from head to toe with no sagging or bending. Number 4. Your head is relaxed and you should be looking at the floor. Number 5. Hold the position for as long as you can. Number 6. Remember to breathe by inhaling slowly and steadily. Number 7. When your form begins to suffer, pull the plug. You're only benefiting from planks when your form is good. How long do you think you can hold a plank position? Share your answer in the comments below. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. For more interesting facts on the human body, subscribe to the channel.